Do women prefer dad bods? This is something I've been conflicted with since seeing more and more videos online, and especially after seeing the king of podcasting's views on this, which may be more extreme. No girl wants a dad bod, do they? The some, only reason why a woman would want a dad bod is because they know that the guy has like less options, so he's more likely to stick around. <laughs> Joe Rogan does not have a dad bod, by the way. In fact, he's absolutely jacked out of his mind. So is he correct in his views? Nearly 75% of people are a fan of the dad bod, according to a study that was done on 2,000 participants from dating.com, which basically means... For a soft, round male body, in comparison to a more muscular one. And just to give the study reference, people like Leonardo DiCaprio and Will Smith have been considered to have dad bods. It's the kind of body that looks capable, physically fit and healthy, but not to the extreme. Just for reference, people like Jason Momoa, who have also been cited to have dad bods, are not the epitome or reference point of dad bods. This is literally fucking off-season source house bodybuilder who's just put on a bit of body fat. But I wanted to test, what do the general public think of the dad bod? <laughs> but before heading out, it was time to ask my two noble steeds. Yeah, hey, what, what do you think more people on the high street, general public, gonna go for? Body type one? Mm-hmm. Oh, body type two. What do you think more people are gonna go for? Body type one. You think more people go for body type one? Mm-hmm. Why? Type preference. Uh, no. Why? Yeah. It's just a bit more maintainable, isn't it? What's your preference? And what's your preference? My preference is the second one. Because I look like the second one. <laughs> That's your reason, because I look like the second one. The way you can find some attractors if, if you, you see yourself in them. But like, I... <laughs> but I'm, I think I'm more attracted to... He clearly is very dedicated. He works yes. out. I'm also yeah, dedicated and also work out yeah, um, in places before. Thing is, of those two body types, which is most like your long term partner? Yeah, second, I think you know? it's, I'm it's attracted quite obvious. to that. Yeah, yeah. But of course. I also don't think that's a bad thing if you are. But the thing is, I reckon most men would be a, would say I would want to look like the second one. Yes, I'll I agree. Say. So we headed out onto the winter cold streets of Chester to try and find our first sample of women to reflect on the dad bod. So looking at these like two body types, that's body type one and that's body type two. What would be like your physical preference? Probably body type two. Body type two. Yeah. And why do you think that would be your preference? Just because they look like they go to the gym more, they look like they'd live a more active lifestyle. Number one. one. Number one. And why do you think that would be your preference? That, I don't know. Number two just looks a bit I can like... cuddle number one. Yeah. <laughs> <More goodly. laughs> yeah. Number two seems like spending more time at the gym. It had started out fairly balanced, but I was interested to see the impact of group agreeability and group cohesion would have on the answers. The second one. <laughs> Uh, yeah. I'd say one. I was just say one. a middle ground would be nice. <laughs> well, yeah, a middle ground, but if I had to choose one. Number one. And why would you choose number one? More to cuddle. Well, if you had to choose, it was like life or death. Uh, it's yeah, the, the first one. The first one. Uh, otherwise, just too hot, like, yeah. <laughs> you feel too like pressure to look like that. Yeah, they're just, so <laughs> they're just solid, not, yeah. Not <laughs> the dad bod's taken an early lead, which backs up the data from dating.com. But what would happen if I asked a, a younger demographic? Is that, one on steroids? Is that one on steroids? <laughs> why, why would you think that? Because it's not. It doesn't look doesn't natural. Doesn't look natural. No, uh, number two. Well, the other one can get fitter though. So one. <laughs> so one. So one. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Number yes, one. Yeah. And just for the preference that he could get fitter. One's cute. I think. One. Is that no, one? Yeah. That's number one. And why? Why would you say number one? I don't know. It's just cute. You know, you know, for some body no. types. But if you have to end up with one of them for the rest of your life. Uh, one. One. So. And for what reason? I just think I'd be more comfortable. Oh, do, just, you, do you think it put more pressure on yourself to feel yeah, like you'd, yeah. you'd have to work out? Yeah, I'd be more comfortable, yeah. The dad bod seems to be taking a renowning lead, and it wasn't too much of a shock, to be honest, because after doing some of my own research, it already backed up the narrative of what I'd found out. But I wanted to ask three more women before really diving into the why the women prefer the dad bod. Dad bod. Dad bod. <laughs> Nailed it. Type one. Type, type one. one. Yeah. And why? Um, just because it's more realistic. More realistic. Yeah. And you'll be type one, you say? Yeah, yeah. No, type one. Because it's kind of on my same level as me, so... <laughs> okay. Type one. Yeah. Just being realistic, yeah. So the dad bod was an all-out KO, with over 90% of the women that we asked today preferring the dad bod, which trumped the 75% from the dating.com study. With some of the reasonings behind today's results from the women being that the built bod or the fit bod wouldn't be cuddly and feel too hard, that it would put higher expectations on themselves 
And also that it just looked like they're on steroids. I still wanted to look a little further into this of why guys put so much pressure on themselves to try and achieve these Adonis godlike physiques when women just prefer something, well, a little softer. So I decided to have a little look into this further and looked at some studies on the male and female preferences. It was consistently shown that men prefer a more physically attractive female, whereas women preferred a man with more wealth, power, and earning potential. Also, women more so than men have been shown to settle for guys who rank lower on the physical attractiveness. Maybe this plays into the real reason of why women actually do prefer the dad bod or don't mind the dad bod and why men maybe value their own physical traits more than women actually do because they themselves value that in potential partners. I also believe that movies and TV shows probably tend to blow up this idealism of the Barbie and Ken look that isn't actually a reality, which then gives people the idea that they actually need to look similar to find their ideal match. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please drop a like. If this is your first time visiting my channel, subscribe. I'll catch you in the next one. Bye, guys. Don't finish up for the shit. I'll tap when I 